Hi everyone, it's Living the Good Life and I have another video here for you. Um, I have a holdover from the church rummage sale and then for some actual estate sales. So when I went to the church rummage sale, I forgot to mention that I found this little 14 karat gold necklace with a little tiny heart uh, on it for um, a dollar in this little cellophane envelope. So they didn't have much jewelry, but it was like stuck here and there. I guess they, whenever anybody brought it, they just didn't accumulate it into one spot. So I was lucky there. Then went to another sale and I got these Spice of Life Corning Wear for a dollar a piece. So I got that one and then I got this taller one. Not a loaf pan, but interesting. There we go. And then for $5, there was a bag of um, this silverware that you may have seen in my short. It had $5 on it and it had this little basket, which turned out to be made in Sweden silver plate. There were two sterling silver spoons in it, which is why I went ahead and got it. There was this one. And then there was this one, which is Michigan. What are, you can see that better than me. So there we go. And it says sterling as well. There were a couple of butter knives. There was this, I really was hoping that this one would be silver as well, but it's just silver plate. Cocktail spoon and a little tiny spoon. So for $5, let's weigh the two ones that are actually silver. And they are 32.57. So silver is up to like $31 an ounce right now, if you didn't know. And that is a really good deal. So that was over $30. Um, let's see. And then went to a sale and I got this inkwell on a stand. So it's really pretty. It's pink. Has a little bow and flowers around. It says sax on it. So this would be German. And look at the pretty little stand that it's on. So that was $3. And at the same place, I got this. So everything, not everything was marked yet. I found like sterling silver small candelabras, a couple of footed vases, um, a sterling handled meat fork, a one silver teaspoon. As soon as I brought them up to her to get a price, um, they went sky high. But somehow this one was missed. It was $5 and it wasn't on the bottom. It was here, marked here on the side. Again, let me find it right there. Sterling. So that one weighs 107 grams. So 31, uh, 107 divided by 31.1 times 0.925 times $31 gives you an idea of how much it is. So it's over three ounces. So that was a good one. Uh, at that same, oh, I forgot to mention, let's see. At the same sale where I got this silverware, I found this little, I asked where the jewelry was. Oh, it's still in the car. <laughs> so they went and got it and brought it out. And I passed on a piece of like jade. I probably should have gotten it, but it was $20. And it wasn't green, it was like a white and gray. This is uh, sterling, you can see it marked up at the top. $2, that's that little baggie. And then they had cleaned out the jewelry box, but there were still a couple of rings. And I found this in there and it was a dollar and it's 14 karat gold. Um, and it weighs 1.76 grams. So all of you, metal enthusiasts, you'll know how to do that. Um, and then the last thing is the last sale of the day that we went to, should have been one of the first that we went to, two tables worth of, ju worth of jewelry. I found one pair of earrings <clears throat> that were trying to be a Native American that were sterling silver, multicolored stones. I just wasn't through into them, um, put them back, but no telling what I missed. Um, so live and learn. But if you remember, Last year, I got the Sabino glass birds. Well, I found two more. They were in a sack marked $6 for the two birds. I got them for five. So this is a knife rest. Isn't it pretty? And it says Sabino right there. Sabina, 
Sabino, I don't know. Anyways, that's a knife rest. Very pretty opalescent glass. So now I have four of these. I am just thrilled. Here's the other one. This is more like what I already have, a little fat birdie. It says Sabino as well underneath. Isn't it pretty? So, four of those. And I am, whoop, he wants to fall down. There we go. So I am thrilled with those. Hope you enjoyed seeing the finds. I have more to come and I appreciate it. I really appreciate your subscription. Take care.